Hello guys, it is Sunday, June 2nd, 2, 10 a.m. Um, not a whole lot of work done today. I was celebrating my mom's birthday. So, I'm going to do that. Good news though, um, Squarespace, which, Squarespace, which is the people I bought my domain off of for dropshipping, they uh, got back with me and they sent me an email on how to uh, get my um, password back. So, I'm really hoping it works. Because I haven't tried it yet. They sent it to me earlier today. Uh, if I look at it right now, actually. Uh, there it is. Oh, where is it? There it is. Yeah, basically, um, he apologized for the delay, which was so kind of him. But basically, they uh, he sent me a link to uh, log into my Squarespace account. You can reset your password. Uh, they don't, I don't think they understand what I'm talking about. Oh well, worst thing that ha I don't really think I'll have trouble with it though, because all I'll have to do is connect my um. I'm just create gonna create oh, cause usually it's like hello at, and then your business name dot com, so it would be like hello at youtube dot com, and that would always be at like the bottom right corner. So because I can't figure that out, I think I'm just gonna put like my brand name and then at gmail dot com, cause I don't think anybody's really gonna care what the difference is i don't know if you guys think it will let me know but um otherwise i don't think it will so that's the news for today so i'll just get straight to the quotes of the day i'm really tired yeah one thing i noticed about oh my god one thing i've been getting really distracted by is my xbox for my tvs downstairs it's not even mine it's my dad's because um we had one we had this extra tv and so uh, when we moved, I put it in my dad's room because I already had this small one right above me that you guys can't see. But that one's bigger, so I like it better. But uh, my Xbox has been distracting me a lot. So actually, before I go to bed tonight, I'm going to unplug it and uh, put it back in my backpack and then put my backpack away because it, it, it just makes me want to play the Xbox because like, I feel like, like I need to level up or something like that. I don't know. But it's really distracting, so I'm getting rid of it. Um, oh, also, this week, uh, I believe it's Wednesday, yep, uh, the 5th through the 8th, I may or may not respond, I went to a church thing called Blast, I don't know if any of you guys watching this have heard of that, basically, uh, churches from within, uh, you know, the state of Ohio go up to Wooster, and so, you know how, like, in school districts, like, so for me, my basketball school district is KMAC. So for you, like, basically there's different districts of churches and they all, we all met up in Wooster, Ohio and we did like a bunch of events there or whatever, like all a bunch of fun or whatever. We did, vo I signed up for volleyball and basketball, volleyball we won, basketball, uh, my team lost, it was like a three on three thing, that didn't do, we didn't do good, surprisingly. But then surprisingly, like I thought I did really good compared to the rest of my, and I wasn't trying to sound selfish, but I felt I did really good compared to the rest of my team for volleyball. <laughs> Because I was taller than most of my team. And I was spiking it on like every other dude. Which were surprisingly very tall as well. Um, but that was fun. And we won everything. We won the championship actually for that game. But um, I did not get selected for that. But surprisingly for basketball. Even though we lost after three rounds out of like 12. Um, they selected me out of like 70 other people. To go to... Um, regionals so basically we'll go to mount vernon nazarene university and we will um i'll have basketball tournaments from the fifth through the eighth depending on how good we do and it'll be a lot of fun because people from like west virginia kentucky indiana and pennsylvania people from churches will be coming up to play us um at like the college and we'll be playing on the main court in front of everyone so it's like really exciting but I may or may not uh, make any videos within that time period due to the fact that I'm at college and not here. So, we've already done that quote, I believe. New quote. Oh, no, we already have that quote. Instead of being ashamed of what you've been through, be proud of what you have overcome by Dr. Phil. Be proud of what you've done. Don't Because, like, you can't, it already happened, right? So, like, if you made a mistake, you can't change what already happened. You messed up. It happened. You can't change that now. So now, be proud of what you did instead of that, right? So, like, let's say you make a mistake or whatever. You're really upset about it. But then let's say later on in the day, you're like, 
oh my gosh, I just passed this history exam. Now you got something to be proud of. Now you got something to be happy about. Because you can't change it. You probably wouldn't change it because you passed. But you made that mistake, so you can't change that anyway. So there's no need to be upset about it, right? Because it already happened. So that's that. Um, also, I saw this video. And it was like, imagine if you had only four years left to live, right? So whatever age you are now, four years under that. Imagine that's what time, like that's the age that you die, right? You would probably want to like get stuff going. So pretend that you don't have much to say. Give yourself a week, just theoretical, this isn't accurate. Give yourself like a week to like a month or whatever of when you want your goal done. Because like you're going to pretend that like you're going to die in like a month. So you want to have your goal done. You already want to start succeeding. And then like continues to do that. And then you might continue to see yourself level up. I'm not sure. Quote of the day, Genesis 2-2. By the seventh day, God had finished the work he had been doing. So on the seventh day, he rested from all of his work. Then God blessed the seventh day and made it holy because on it he rested from all the work of creating that he had done. So that's it for today. Squarespace responded to me. Don't worry about your mistakes. It already happened. You can't fix it. Be proud of yourself for what you have done. So that's it. Hope you all have or will have an amazing day.